Let's set this up together. So iPhone analytics continue. App analytics show app developers. Oh, that was a bit, that was a bit underwhelming. Who wants to see check range jailbreak running on my iPhone 8? Oh, look at this. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's try it. So, all right, let's see. We, if I'm saying we, like there's 10 people in the room. There's, there's one person in the room, just in case you're wondering. Unless actually there is another guy with a, with a pistol. I think this is how it goes. One, two, three. On the check rain, it says right before trigger, but there's no Apple logo. So what has iOS 16 done with this? I wonder. Okay, so check rain doesn't even start. So when it comes to lock screen, okay, uh, let's 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 uh, let's do this. So if I long press, you see customize here. So if I use a, a regular wallpaper, I can't customize this. Okay, I have to go into here, customize, then it will allow me, right? But if this wallpaper was already set by settings, it won't allow you to customize. You see here, you need to add new. So you cannot customize a lock screen with your own wallpaper, right? So not, so not the best. So let's go here. And once we're here, let's do that again. So I'm gonna need to long press and we'll go customize. Now I have all the options. So if I tap onto this, you can see the wallpaper, you can't set your wallpaper. You have to use Apple's wallpaper library. So you can see the background color, okay. We could play around with the uh, the spectrum, just like that. And you can also change like the the shading. You also have the time here, and it's this is so bare bones. It's kind of crazy, like <laughs> it's it's kind of it's kind of crazy how bare bones is. And you see here, you can add a bunch of stuff here, uh, but not much. You cannot move this stuff around either, okay allowed to move around and you can add complications here but it's glitched so you meant to add four you meant to be able to have four that worked that time the last time I tried it sometimes didn't work so let's try this that time it worked but in the past it wasn't working so there you go all right um yeah the lock screen I mean it works I guess you can also add multiple <laughs> but yeah the good thing is though right you had the focus modes, they updated that to the lock screen. So I open up the settings, focus, and then if you go to focus, right, you can change it. So I added a customized lock screen here, and then I use this, this one. So you can change it, so when you're at school, whatever, you know, lock screen changes. Hopefully the school shooter doesn't show up, but you get the point of what I'm trying to say here. All right, so when it comes to the messages app, you can undo the send, which is pretty cool, okay? And you can also edit your current message. So if I edit this, okay, long press, boom, you can edit just like that. Now there's also dictation while typing that doesn't work on the iPhone 8. Uh, so if I use it, if I run the dictation, you can see it blocks me from using the keyboard. So I think you need a newer device. They didn't say that with uh, the WWDC. They just put it in the fine print. They just put it in the fine print. Uh, so that is with the messages and it also added share play, which I don't know what it is, but they added it so you can use it inside the messages and uh, there's more options uh, inside the FaceTime and for the most part, okay, Apple Pay, you have pay later, which is essentially credit. So you buy something and you can pay later 0% APR interest and you get four months. Uh, I don't know if they give that to uh, anyone, but they may give it to some people and uh, you also have CarPlay. They made that one better and they also made you know iCloud share photo library uh if you get a new ipad stuff like that you can um uh, switch the devices so let's say you sign in with one apple id and you're going to give it to a child you can just boom just like that switch everything you can also allow screen time more access you can send an iMessage to your parents and uh, you can grant more screen time via this that's that's everything new with ios 16. 